Angry youth burn down church linked to disappearance of manhood. Angry youth on Tuesday, November 3rd, set ablaze the divine shadow church belonging to one prophet, Joshua Uhembe, accused of being the mastermind behind the alleged disappearance of genitals in Daudu town, Guma local government area of Benue State. This is coming three days after youths in the community staged a protest over missing manhood. It was gathered that Prophet Uhembe and the church president Noah Saka were accused of stealing manhood of seven men in Daudu. According to reports shared on Facebook by members of the community, Prophet Uhembe refused to attend a meeting held by leaders of the community, but his president Saka did, did and allegedly confessed to the crime. He was arrested and handed over to the police. It was learned that the youth got angry over the prophet's refusal to attend the meeting. So they set his church ablaze. Thank you for listening to this news. My viewers, this is a lesson, a big lesson to so many of we Nigerians that are used to going to um, miracle churches. Miracle churches, we want miracle. Miracle, we want miracle. We keep going to different churches, searching for miracle. Searching for miracle. You see? That is what we have just gotten now. You can imagine. A man of God. I'm not surprised because this is their season. That is why one need to be very careful of his movement, his outing, and every move that every, anyone is making now, one need to be conscious of those moves. You have to be very conscious because these people, this is their season. This is their season. They will never leave any stone unturned. Yes, they will never leave any stone unturned. You get it? So we have to be careful. Okay, the man of God, he called himself a man of God, yet he cannot appear. He cannot appear before the villagers if truly he is innocent. He called himself a man of God, yet he still went on, went on to, 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 to look for a way to steal what doesn't belong to him? What doesn't belong to him? If, for instance, now he should put himself in the shoe of the man he has stolen his manhood, how is he going to feel after they finish stealing his own manhood? You can see that we, we human beings, we are very, very heartless. In fact, Disregard the title because that is why I do say that say that pastor is a title. It doesn't justify your being, uh, your being, your being holy. That is why I don't reference that name. I don't reference it and I don't recognize it. Pastor, Reverend, Evangelist, I don't reference it. I don't recognize it. Your Pastorship is in your mind. Your holiness is in the mind. Anyone that we see this man of God, we say that, oh, this man of God is a real man of God. I'm telling you, it's a real man of God. What are we saying? Look at, look at what is found from a man of God. 
And this is the same man of it on Sunday service and be preaching. See, my viewers, we need to be we need to be checking to be checking our men of God now. We need to be checking our men of God now. We need to be mindful of the men of God that we do things with, that we go to to pray and lay hands on us. We need to be careful of them because many of them, their hands are not clean. And that is why I cannot vouch for them. And I will never try it. I will never try it. Don't yet try to vouch for any man of God because majority of them get their powers from the devil. They get their powers from the devil because they want to be famous. They want to be rich. Many of, get, many of them went into the profession because they because, because they, they, they couldn't get a job. That's why many of them went into the profession. Many of them are not called. That's what I'm trying to say. Many of them are not called. So what are we saying? So we have to be careful with these people. We have to be mindful of these people and how they trick us with their faith miracles, with their lying miracles, miracles that doesn't work, miracles that they get the powers from the devil. Didn't you hear one 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 um, um, abalis that was that was that was revealing those those pastors that are coming to get powers from him? Saying that he's going to expose them since they have not come to pay their pay, pay their dues. How? What a mess. This is good for some of the women, some of our women that hope from one church to another, hope from one um, um, congregation to another, saying that, oh, I am looking for miracle. That is the miracle you have seen it now. Yeah? Let me do with it. Yeah? What do with it now? You ask for it. Problem. Problem. We are our problem. We are the one causing problem to ourselves. So, hmm. My viewers, this is the time we need to be careful. This is the time we need to be mindful. Alright? So, my viewers, Please and please deem it fit to leave your comments below the comment box. Click on the subscription button as well as the bell button to get updated whenever we upload any new videos. Thank you.